The U.S. Air Force has approved the necessity of developing a sixth-generation manned fighter as part of the Next Generation Air Dominance NGAD, program following an internal analysis. Nevertheless, the prospective Trump administration is anticipated to make a final decision based on cost and other factors, which could result in a delay. The objective of the NJAD program is to create a sixth-generation fighter capable of adapting to the changing requirements of contemporary warfare. In July of this year, the NGAD program was temporarily suspended by U.S. services, primarily due to budget constraints and the necessity of conducting a more comprehensive assessment of potential threats. In the interim, the Air Force is extending existing contracts to further develop NGAD technologies and design concepts. This extension enables industry competitors, including Boeing and Lockheed Martin, to modify their cost estimates and refine their proposals in response to the program's pause. Northrop Grumman, which had previously withdrawn from the competition, has expressed a willingness to re-enter if the program requirements are altered. This is particularly noteworthy. The F-22 Raptor was to be replaced by an advanced fighter, and the NGAD program was established to develop such a fighter. The Collaborative Combat Aircraft, CCA, is also a member of the NGAD family. It is a semi-autonomous unmanned aircraft that will function as a wingman to the principal fighter. The program was developed in 2014 to guarantee that the U.S. Air Force would preserve its air superiority in the years ahead, as per a report by the Congressional Research Service, CRS. The NJAD program has since investigated various power plant options. The XA-102 engine prototype is being developed by General Electric, while the XA-103 engine prototype is being developed by Pratt & Whitney. The Trump administration will be responsible for the final decision regarding NGAD, as determined by the U.S. Air Force earlier this month. The objective of the present internal analysis is to furnish comprehensive information that will facilitate a thorough decision-making process. The decision-making process may be extended by the future administration's desire to undertake its own review. The $300 million price tag per aircraft for the next generation fighter must be determined by U.S. Congress members to determine whether it is justified and meets the Air Force's requirements. They may also contemplate a redesign in order to reduce costs, which could potentially compromise the service life. The primary contenders for the development of NGAD are Lockheed Martin and Northrop Grumman. Next-generation fighter designs have been previously presented by Lockheed's Skunk Works division. Nevertheless, the contenders may be influenced by the uncertainties surrounding the program's ultimate approval. Elon Musk and other prominent figures associated with Trump have expressed skepticism regarding the cost of manned aircraft, instead advocating for a focus on unmanned systems. This viewpoint has the potential to influence future policy decisions concerning the role of NGAD in the U.S. military strategy. Musk's criticism of the F-35 program, which serves as an illustration of his advocacy for unmanned systems over conventional manned aircraft, may prompt the administration to reconsider the focus of NGAD. This viewpoint is consistent with the more extensive discussions within defense circles regarding the future equilibrium between manned and unmanned platforms in the pursuit of air superiority. In addition, the Trump administration's broader defense policy priorities, which include the potential for changes in military leadership and a focus on reducing perceived woke practices, may indirectly influence decisions related to NGAD. In determining the program's future trajectory, the administration's approach to defense spending, technological innovation, and military readiness will be critically important. Now, do you think Elon Musk will shut down NGAD program? Let us know in the comments. Please like and share our videos and subscribe to our channel. Please also take membership in our channel to encourage us.